So let's jump into this subject. Hershey is sued by a New Yorker over alleged chocolate containing heavy metals. Consumer reports found dangerous heavy metals in chocolate from Hershey's, Theo Trader, Joe's, and other popular brands are the ones that had the most and some that are safer. They tested 28 bars for lead and cadmium. This was to determine the risk posed by the chocolates. Said they used California's maximum allowable dose amount. For lead, it's 0.5 microgram, and for cadmium, it's 4.1. For the 23 bar, eating just an ounce a day would put an adult over a level that the public health authorities say may be harmful. At least just one of those heavy metals. That's risky stuff. Long-term exposure to even small amounts can cause a variety of health problems. The danger is greater in pregnant women and in young children, which can cause developmental problems. But, of course, there is a risk at any age. It can lead to nervous system problems, hypertension, immune system suppression, kidney damage, and reproductive issues. Most people don't eat chocolate every day, but 15% do. Here is you a list of chocolates that had high levels of lead and candom in it, and ones that are safe, supposedly, to eat. Tony's, Lily's, Godiva, Chocolate, Lint, Dove even, Hershey's. I mean, it's a list. Was our spices, and now our chocolates. I think I'm going to take a deeper dive in a lot of these foods. Country crazy out.